So you might be trying to figure out how you can go through and find a lost Samsung phone. Now, there's a couple of different ways to go and do this for the most part. Now, number one, if you have the ability of going to inside like a different type of device or something like that, your laptop, whatever you have, hopefully your Samsung device adds some sort of like find my option enabled inside of it. So what you can do is you can go through inside of your particular you know, internet browser on side of your other device, it doesn't have to be this one, just a different one. And you're going to want to search for smart things find. So just like this, search up for smart things find on Google. And all you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and find the Samsung smart things find little website that they have here. Then when you come into this page, what it's going to do is it's going to allow you to sign in. Now you can also download the Google Play application if you want to for this for smart things. But if you don't have that, you can still access it via your phone, like for your, your you know other web browser inside of your laptop or whatever you have. Now, here's the thing, right? This specific website, you want to sign in with your Samsung account. If you did not have this capability signed in to your Samsung account, then you might not be able to find it, but it's still worth a shot. So go inside of here, try seeing if you can locate like all your devices. So you can click right here and you can go and try seeing it this way, locate device even if they're offline. You might be able to recover your Samsung account by logging in and trying to find your Samsung phone that way. If that doesn't work, you can also try using Google's Find My Device. So click right back into your search bar and search up just like how I searched up right here, find my device for Google, and then you can do the exact same thing here. So you can sign into your Google account, you can go and see if your phone was lost or stolen, and you can go ahead and basically find your device without even signing in, which is kind of crazy. So if the Samsung one doesn't work, try using this Google one, and one of them hopefully will end up working for the most part. So in terms of that, that kind of covers it up there for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.